lot of you guys have been trying to look for the M135i or the M140. Got the car and how to use it. I know how to install it from, and I'm going to show you all how to do it and how to use it. So there is one with a bug, and I'm going to show you how to fix that. Yes, yes, come to Papa. Without further ado, let's get straight into it. So you join me on the desktop, head on over to web browser, type in Modland, then head on over to Beam and G Drive. Just type BMW One. This one with thirteen thousand downloads. Okay, hit download. I'll say this. <laughs> It'll say this a few times, but click, click in until you've hit download. If you have Norton or anything like that, don't worry. It's not a virus. It's just some of your antivirus software are a bit itchy with certain files i don't know why i don't use anything like that i just use just to show you that it is the right car documents find ng drive moved here mods there's all your mods open up your downloads folder downloads i'm just going to cut it and then paste it in here uh, see I've already got it there so I'm just going to replace file and destination. Open up Beam NG Drive and then you should see your car once you're loading the game but I would suggest just going to repository, mod manager and just press activate all mods and then hop into a game, any map you would like. I just go onto any old map. Once you load it in, let all the graphics do its thing. I'm going to change my environment to sunset. Open vehicles, find the BMW, which is this one. You have a few different models. You can create your own, which I have here previously. So I'm just going to replace current model. Right, and this is where it gets interesting. The car has a problem. And the only way to make this car work, guys, is just turn the traction control off. That's the only problem with this car. And you now can drive it perfectly. With no issues. It is a pre-facelift, but... I wouldn't use a new one. There's a new one inside uh, BeamNG Drive and it's a terrible car. This one is so much better. Like the, the detail on this car is loads better than any other ones I've ever seen. Um, like the inside looks good. I can't really see it, it's a bit dark right now. But yeah, this car is the best BMW you can get. And I think it's about three to 400 brake horsepower. There is a dyno mod, if you check out the other video, there's a dyno mod for you to check. But let's have a little drive, I'll go and give it a little crash. Yuck. Let's crash it into that wall there, look. Okay. There you go. See, the level of detail is fantastic. It works absolutely fine, no problems whatsoever, no, cr no crashing. It's all good, listen. Don't worry about it. I've got you covered. If you ever want any other cars guys, do me a favor, drop down in the comments below if you would like any other cars. I can get a few different cars. Um, just let me know if you want them and I can try and help. But that is basically it for this video, how you install them and how you drive them, that's it. Easy as that. Don't forget to hit subscribe and don't forget to like the video guys and I will catch you on the next one. Peace out.